Hi, I'm Selena Hill with NV Magazine, and we're here at the Hugh Mann Bookstore and Cafe to meet Kelly Goff, political analyst and author, for her first official book signing of her new book, The GQ Candidate. Woo! You know that thing, that love thing, make me want to sing. Ms. Kelly Goff, tell us what inspired you to write a novel based on a contender for president that's black and Jewish. What was the inspiration behind this? Well, you know what's interesting is I've joked that I, I found Senator, then Senator Barack Obama and Senator John McCain to be the least interesting people on the 2008 campaign trail. I was always far more intrigued by the people around them, especially Michelle Obama and Valerie Jarrett, and even the Palin kids. You know, I was always wondering, I wonder what this person's thinking in this moment where their life is completely changing because the person they're friends with or that they're married to has now just become this overnight sensation. So that's why I wanted to do a book that was about what happened to a group of friends and a family when one of them decides to run for president. It's your first novel, fictional novel that you ever wrote. Can you just tell us why is it so different from everything else you ever written? Well, fiction's hard. It's harder than it looks. I actually found writing this book tougher than writing my first book because the thing about nonfiction is, in a way, your ideas are your ideas and your facts are your crutch, right? If you have an interesting idea and you have facts and figures and poll numbers to back it up, then even if people aren't that enthralled with the writing, they will say, you yeah, know, but there were some interesting ideas there. And you don't have that to fall back on with fiction. And it's very scary, I found. It was really scary trying to finish this. Um, and, you know, I've joked with friends that, you know, nonfiction is the logistical Olympics because there's so many moving parts. You have to interview people. You can't control their schedules. You have to get research. You can't control how the research is going to turn out. But fiction is the creative Olympics because it's all on you. It's all on you and your imagination and your creativity. So it was a challenge, but it was also one of the most rewarding things I've ever done. Lee Wells, why was it so important for you to support Kelly Goff today at her book signing? Well, you know, I mean, uh, Kelly is like an, an important voice in, uh, in black America and young black America. And she's an important political voice. And, you know, she's written her first novel and she's very wonderful. And so I thought I'd come out and hear what she had to say. Can you just tell us why is her voice so important in the political sphere in black America uh, as a commentator? Well, it's, it's important to have um, a v voices out there that are kind of rational and that pay attention uh, to, to how things really work, not, not how people... There are a lot of political commentators who will tell you how they think things should work. Uh, I think that what she's doing is she's saying how things are really working, and that's very important to, to be able to make rational decisions. Amel, can you tell us what is so compelling about the storyline of the GQ candidate? I think what's really compelling about the GQ candidate that is that it's about you know a black candidate who is adopted by a white family, but it's also about the socialization of politics. So it's about what happens to a, you know a group of friends and when the friends decides to run for politics. So there's social media, there's drama, there's intrigue, um, and I think it's just a very relevant story about what happens today in the media and politics and how it affects real people. And tell us, what does Kelly Goff's voice bring to literature, politics? We know she's also a writer mm -hmm. for Essence, Essence.com. So yeah. what is she bringing? Well, Kelly is a political pundit. So she's so smart. She's so well informed about politics. So she's taken all that political knowledge that she knows and filtered it through fiction. Um, she's a great blogger. So she writes all the time. So she's a very fluid writer. Um, but what I like is that when you read her novel, it's almost like you're reading one of her blogs. And it just feels very realistic and very current and very fast-paced. Like It's almost like you're on Twitter, you're on Facebook, you're on a blog, but you're actually reading a novel. Well, one of the things that was so intriguing about her book is that she's talking about a young candidate, Af African-American, who was running for president. Obviously, it brings you back to the thoughts of President Obama, who we supported in 2008. And I really thought this is the kind of event that young professionals should be a part of. You know, we get to be a part of hearing about things that are related to change and related to political change and civic change. And that was how the organization was founded. And so mm -hmm. to support Kelly Goff in this book makes a lot of sense from the book's perspective, but also from Kelly Goff's perspective, because she is a young professional who is making a lot of changes, very active in the in the blogging community, Huffington Post on MSNBC. So we also wanted to support her and give her a lot of awareness to our community so people know 
who a Kelly Goff is and what she's doing, and maybe that might inspire some of them to do um, more things like what Kelly's doing. Well, we primarily support events related to politics and civic engagement, so that's kind of the platform of the, of the organization. So we've done a number of watch parties when there's big political speeches. We've hosted other events related to uh, raising funds for different candidates and causes. So whatever, wherever possible for us to get people civically engaged and politically engaged, we want to take that opportunity. Hi, I'm Selena Hill with NV Magazine, and we just wrapped up the first official book signing for Miss Kelly Goff's new book, The GQ Candidate. Amazing, you were